Hey everybody. So today I wanted to come to you with a bit of an update uh, on the My doTERRA journey, give you my first impressions on product and uh, some of the effects that the products have had on me over the course of this last week or so. So uh, to start off with, the one thing that I, I really noticed uh, really after day one and into day two was that my coffee intake was going to have to change. Uh, and the reason I knew that is because my beard felt like it was on fire all the time. Uh, my, the caffeine load was, was far too high now, now that I had, you know, a, a more complete uh, nutritional profile in my system. And so what I did was, I love my coffee, it's never going to go away, I'm sure. What I did was I switched to 50% decaf. And honestly, now I'm even to a less than that, um, simply because I just don't need it. Um, I don't feel like I need it to clear up morning fog, uh, which is a, a very, for coffee drinkers, that's a, a very serious issue that you have to deal with in the morning, if, especially when you try to go decaffeinated, um, is that you feel like you're in that uh, semi days for a while until you get your proper caffeine in you. Uh, and there's a thousand memes that, point that out. Uh, but one thing that I noticed was within a couple of days of taking uh, the doTERRA Cleanse and Restore Kit, that uh, that fog was gone. And so, and I noticed that now, and like, again, I'm, I'm on, this is, well, technically this is day nine in the morning, but for the last eight days, uh, it, it took almost no time to, to, for me to experience that. Now, I will like give you a little caveat to that is I was taking a whole food supplement before and I have been for, for many, many moons. So my body was really accustomed to taking supplements. Uh, like anything that you take uh, into your body, it will take a period of time before you're going to see the full effects of that. And literally every manufacturer on the planet, pharmaceuticals included, will tell you that it takes a while to get the full effect of what you're taking. Pharmaceuticals, it happens at a much quicker rate, but there are side effects. So with natural products, it, it is, seems to be a little slower on the uptake, but there is literally no downside. So I'll, I'll take the patient way. It's almost like losing weight. Uh, you didn't gain it all in one day and you really shouldn't try to lose it all in one day. So, um, but overall, as far as the cleanse part of the kit goes, um, again, a, a, I saw a minor change um, in as far as how my digestive processes went. The, the, um, that didn't seem to be a huge difference. The one thing that was a huge difference was that my stomach was not bloated all the time. So one thing that uh, I have an issue with is uh, usually whenever I uh, eat something that I shouldn't be eating, that I know I shouldn't be eating, uh, I swell. I, I have a, a histamine reaction and I swell up. And so my stomach will look like that I have eaten like Thanksgiving dinner and, you know, the, the typical joint pain and wrist pains and ankles and all that other stuff aggravated by the fact that I have an extra piece in my back. So those things, inflammation is a serious problem for me uh, as far as my m mobility and being able to function. Plus brain fog is a direct result of inflammation. So what I noticed was that was down. Um, it's The weather is crappy right now. It desperately needs to rain. Barometric pressure is off the chart. Um, what I am experiencing, which is normal for that kind of, uh, of environment, is I am feeling the pressure that I would normally feel, but I am not feeling the joint pain that I normally would experience. Again, 52 years old, you know, we have accepted that certain pains are come along with life, but I have a lot of wear and tear on my body, so I really should expect it to be quite honest with you. So um, the cleanse and restore part has literally just been absolutely beautiful. Um, again, it's, these are not, it's not a harsh cleanse. Uh, this is not Drano, you know, it's not colon blow as Linda likes, Lindsay, excuse me, uh, likes to refer to it as, uh, it is a, a work with your body, natural kind of process. So, uh, highly recommend it. The, uh, the entire product line so far, I've had l no problems with my stomach doesn't get crampy. Uh, I don't feel like I'm wired to the gills. Uh, I fall asleep when it's time to fall asleep. Uh, 
Uh, I'm not up until two or three o'clock in the morning, uh, which happens a lot of times when you're taking things that are maybe not quite so natural uh, and they end up just being stimulants in your system. And that's really not what you need is you need a, a complete, you know, a nutritional profile and then your body takes care of that. So uh, you, again, like I said on the previous video, um, you, you know, you don't want to like ride one horse too long. You know, you, you want to spread out your nutritional intake, which is one of the reasons why I say things like eat the rainbow and vary your diet because you get different nutrients in it. Being able to take those nutrients in, in a, a capsulated form, especially the way they're set up, uh, these are, you know, uh, basically all you know, gel caps or, uh, you know, uh, cellulose caps. And so they're very easy to take. Uh, even with me now, this is the cleansers. There's several pills that go with that. I'm a person that can take a handful at once, uh, which I do so, without a problem. There's no, you know, I me mean, again. Uh, they're they're properly made and made to be swallowed without incident. So uh, really, I just can't. I mean, at this point, I have no complaints whatsoever. Uh, it does exactly what it says it's going to do. Um, you know, I can feel a, a tangible difference in several aspects uh primarily uh my gut my stomach number one thing that uh, i have noticed within with just in eight or nine days of taking any of their products whatsoever is that my stomach is not extended distended extended <laughs> something else needs extended um my stomach is not distended uh, like it has been uh, for years. And, and honestly, it's been one of those things I struggle with because I, I, real, I know that I'm not that big, and, but it looks like I am. And so that has gone away. And so that has literally, I mean, it, it looks like I've trimmed up, you know, 15 or 20 pounds and I haven't. It. It's just my stomach is not bloated anymore. Um, my sleep patterns. Okay, so that's another thing that changed dramatically is uh, I'm a person that generally does not sleep very much. If I sleep five hours a night or six hours a night, I'm, I'm ready to rock and roll. Uh, this may seem a little odd to you, but I sleep more now uh, and I sleep a more rested night. And so now I can actually go to bed and uh, some of you will appreciate this. I can sleep in. Okay, so I can sleep in. That's something I've not been able to do for a long time because my I think my system was so out of kilter that uh, even waking up at dawn and going out, letting natural sun get on my face, you know, I, I did everything that I could to get my circadian rhythms uh, in line to sleep a normal restful period of time. What I was finding was that I would sleep this short period of time at night, but then I would get through the day no matter what I ate didn't matter how healthy I ate, didn't matter what volume that I ate, I would get through the middle of the day and literally would, would almost have to just go lay down uh, because I wasn't able to do anything, which is completely exhausted because my body was out of gas. So I don't have that anymore. Uh, I find myself at six, seven, eight o'clock at night and never having gone through any a period to where I felt like that I was super low energy. One thing that has happened, again, which is new because of my stomach issues as I get hungry. Now, some of you may not be able to appreciate that, but my system was, a, was so far out of whack that I knew, I personally knew that it was taking probably about 18 hours for food to pass through my system. Now you're saying, gosh, Brian, there's no way that you can know that. Well, yeah, there is. So what I did as a way of an experiment, and because I, I must be like sick in the head, was I, on an empty stomach, took some spicy hot Doritos, I mean like flaming hot Doritos, and ate about, I don't know, two servings of it on an empty stomach. Now, for those of you who have ever consumed products like that, you know there's an inevitable end that is coming to consuming that product. So what I wanted to do was I wanted to see how long it took before I was sorry that I made that decision and it was 18 hours. So I knew there was something seriously wrong going on uh, just from that little thing right there. And like I said, and I, it's very unusual for me to ever actually experience hunger feelings. 
Uh, I think honestly, probably because my stomach was never actually completely emptying out because it wasn't really digesting the food. Uh, and it was causing, you know, uh, uh, again, like gastrointestinal issues and constant pain. Anytime I would put food in my stomach, I would get cramping. That was alleviated to a certain, to a certain point almost immediately with the, the doTERRA lemon drops that I don't have anywhere near me to show you what I'm talking about, but I, that's on a, there. Um, that, curb that almost immediately, the negative impact of coffee on my stomach. If you're a, a, a I want to say heavy coffee drinker, but if your coffee is heavy, if you have a very, if you have a cappuccino or espresso level of coffee that you drink in the morning, that's a lot of stimulant on your stomach at once. Uh, and even though the, for the first day, couple days, I still did that, drinking the lemon water was enough to actually take that away. Now, since then, I have, as I said previously, uh, I have removed uh, a good chunk of the caffeinated coffee in my or, you know, morning regimen, as it were. Uh, and I, I clearly, as you can tell here, I sound completely over-caffeinated, but I promise you this is the least amount of caffeine that I've probably ever done a video on in my whole life. So, uh, plenty of good energy. My head is clear. Uh, my mood is stable. My emotions are under control. Um, and I say that because, I, you know, our family has a tendency to be excessively animated over things that really probably shouldn't be bothering us. And I have noticed, even though there's some really, really poopy things that are going on in the world, um, I'm able to cope with those things. Uh, and so, I, I feel more calm and more at peace, I guess. Um, because if you know anything about stressors and, and in the world, you know, it makes you vitamin deficient uh, when you're stressed out. So, but when you, if you can replace those nutrients that your body is using up to deal with this, then that's where you're, I get you, I believe that's where the, the peace and the calm kind of comes from, from the, the body being able to function the way that we were created to function. So, uh, let me see, am I forgetting anything? No, I, I think that's probably pretty much it. Uh, like I said, it's only been about eight days, so there's, I know there was not going to be a lot that I was actually going to be able to relay to you, but those, the, the, the core things, the, the, the gut health and the sleep, which were the two things that I really felt like that I needed some help with because I knew they were not functioning properly, uh, even though I was still able to, to get by. Because, uh, you know... You do what you got to do, and uh, whether you're functioning right or not functioning right uh, is irrelevant to what the task load is. So, uh, but this definitely made it a lot easier, and again, it has helped me uh, to be more productive because I'm not dealing with you know uh, stomach problems or not sleeping, being excessively tired, not being able to think clearly. Uh, if you're in a creative field or if you have a job where you have to problem solve, you need your head clear. And uh, that's some, one of the things that I noticed literally within, I want to say probably the third, probably the fourth day was I noticed my morning brain, brain fog was gone when I got out of bed without, you know, with no stimulants whatsoever and not having taken any, you know, I just woke up. So, and the brain fog was gone. So thumbs up for that one. So, um, I will going to continue on with this. I still have about another, uh, 20 days left in this, the, the cleanse and restore kit program. And, uh, every week or whenever something else maybe props up that I think maybe might be interesting, uh, I'll hop in here and get you updated. Uh, and then like I said, at the end of the 30 days, we'll do an overall review and then kind of decide on uh, what we'll do from there. So, all right. Thanks for stopping in. I'll see you later. Bye. Bye.